What's up, YouTube? It's Okay, Dad. I uh, want to talk to you guys about what I'm gonna, what direction I'm gonna take the channel. Uh, Mondays, I'll be talking about uh, competitive Yu-Gi-Oh, competitive decks, uh, the top deck of the format. I happen to be playing Hieratic Rulers. Um, you may or may not agree that it's the best deck in the format. It probably isn't, but it is definitely a contender. And then on Fridays, we'll be talking about casual decks. Um, I think casually, I'll be playing Psychics. Uh, that's like one of my pet decks, Psychics. And uh, we'll see where that goes. We'll see where that goes from there. See if you guys uh, like that. Because I know a majority of my um, fan base are casual players. And I don't ever want to forget about the base, uh, the base of my subscribers. But, but people also that know me know that I'm a competitive player. And I do have a strong desire to get better. And the only way I can do that is to also put some focus on my competitive play. <clears throat> And so those of you who like competitive decks, competitive theory, um, I'll be addressing those on Mondays. Uh, I guess for you all to just start your competitive, um, for those of you who are casual players but wouldn't mind uh, getting more competitive, the first thing I can do for you is to suggest that you head on over to ARG's article site and check out the series by uh, Johnny Lee. Um, he's written some more or less a thesis on competitive Yu-Gi-Oh! And uh, so far what he's got is amazing. It's, um, it's called the Treatise on Competitive Yu-Gi-Oh! Or uh, I, I can't remember the exact title, but uh, the things that he has outlined there um, I don't think that I possess the mental faculties to write such a piece. Uh, in his current article, uh, he's talking about the scrub mentality. And he's not using scrub in a derogatory sense. He's using it as a, he's using it as just a generic term to describe a person who will make excuses for why they don't perform well, whether it be uh, because they chose an inferior deck or because they have this thing in their mind that won't allow them to use the best possible deck. I mean that I mean like last format dragon uh, dragon rulers with the ravine the best damn deck in the format and then over the past summer during that season you know it was just straight dragon rulers with the babies or if you happen to like prophecy and you know people were saying you know the deck is cheap and I don't want to win that way well you know that's fine if you don't want to win that way but to say that the deck is cheap you know you're really setting up obstacles uh, for your success so you know you should head on over there and he explains it a lot better than I could ever than I ever could and uh, I think you'll learn a lot so, you know, just to reiterate, Mondays we'll be talking about competitive decks, showing competitive decks, uh, talking competitive theory uh, with my competitive deck of choice. And then on Fridays we'll talk about casual decks and, uh, you know, theorize a little bit with my casual deck of choice, Psychics. And um, maybe we all can learn something. It's Dove K. Dad in the mic.